cannabis stocks, and CEO interviews brought to you by Rich TV Live. Hey guys, this is Rich from Rich TV Live. So I want to talk to you guys about my investment that I made into high times. So I made an investment into high times and then I actually made a second investment into high times. So I made an investment of just under 4,000 US into high times, two investments. I believe it was 363 shares at $11 to be exact. And this investment initially was very exciting and I thought it was going to work the way I wanted, but um, things just haven't worked out and haven't gone the way I wanted them to. Now, it's not because I don't like this company. I think this company has a lot of potential. I think this company can do very, very well. Thank you for joining us for the well. High Times Holding Court okay. Regulation A Plus Investor Webinar. High Times is one of the most iconic counterculture brands since its inception in 1974 and today represents one of the most exciting investment opportunities in the modern legal cannabis market. Now. Let's go live to High Time CEO Adam Levin and Dope Media's former CEO and now President George Gage. Thank you very much, Gianna, and welcome to the High Times uh, Investor uh, Webinar today. And Adam, welcome to fabulous sunny Seattle. Amazing, uh, it's sunny today. Beautiful day up here. Um, and to uh, the newly acquired uh, headquarters office from Dope Magazine, it's part of High Time. So I started watching this and I started just doing my due diligence and the investment was supposed to go public in October and then they delayed it and wanted to go in November. And now we're almost into December. So I said, you know what? I am not ready and prepared to wait any longer for this investment. I thought it was going to be in October. So I'd like to know if I can get my money back. And the good news is they have responded to me to say that they will give me my money back in five to 10 business days. So if anybody wants to get their money back, they will get their money back. So high times, thank you very much for honoring the investment and returning my funds. I know other members of my community have already done this as well. So I'm happy that this works. And at least if you do make an investment or you have made an investment, they will refund your money. Okay. So, if you guys would like to know where to get that, just uh, you can comment and I will let you know where you can reach them. And yeah, so I just wanted to make you guys aware that I have decided that I'm not going to continue to invest in high times. It's not because I don't think they're a good company. You can see the revenue is 14.6 million. I just thought about where everything was in the market and I looked at the revenue of 14.6 million and then I looked at companies like Aurora Cannabis that are doing like 30 million a quarter and they're trading at $8 in Canada and this was going to trade at $11 in America. It just wasn't adding up to me. So I had to make a decision that um, just made the right choice. And I had to make sure you, the people knew at home what your options are. I'm not telling you not to buy or to buy or not to buy. Okay. I've not been compensated by high times. Um, I am not working with high times. Okay. High Times, if you'd like to work with Rich TV Live, please let me know. We would love to work with you guys. We think you're a great company. Um, it's just as far as the stock right now, the way the market is going, it's just the market is very heavily oversold, and I'm a little bit concerned about the share price. Now, I hope I'm wrong, and I hope it skyrockets, and this could be a very big bad decision. Um, please, guys, let me know what you guys think. Comment down below. I'm happy that if you make an investment in high times, guys, and you get uh, the ability to return your funds and you want to, they will give you your funds back. So I really like the fact that they're doing that. So that shows me a lot about the company. I kind of was testing it too, wanted to see if they would give me my money back. I'm happy that they are. So I know that they've already said that they would be refunding other members of the community as well. And like I said, I'm not suggesting that you should buy this or you shouldn't buy this. I am just testing it for you, the people at home, letting you know that they are giving me my money back. And if you want your money back, you can get it too. If you want to invest in this company, that's great too. I would love to know if you're investing in this company, uh, why and what you think, you know, where you think it can go. I think it has huge potential. I love high times. I just don't know right now if it's worth $11 in this climate, in this market right now. That's the thing that worries me. Um, 
and I can't control the share price. So uh, I might be wrong though. I mean, like I didn't think that Tilray was worth twenty dollars, and now it's at a hundred. So you never know, right? Like I brought you guys Tilray first, but I didn't buy Tilray at twenty dollars. I was like, whoa, that's a lot. And then I saw Tilray go to a hundred. So this could go to a hundred too. You never know. But I'm not saying it won't. I'm just saying that uh, I don't know. Based on the economic climate right now, a lot of cannabis stocks have been very much under pressure. I have a lot of people trying to prove that they're not worth what they're being traded at. Um, their price to earning ratios have been very high. So with a $11 million a year revenue and $11 share price, it's a very high revenue price to earning ratio. I believe that's about 100 to 1. So these are things we have to think about and uh, you know I hope I'm wrong but I am going to be getting my money back and if you guys would like to know how you can do that just comment down below if you like this video smash the like button I just want to bring you guys the truth if I do something I'm gonna let you know if I don't do it I want to let you know um, what do you guys think are you investing in this are you not investing in this do you think I'm making a good decision do you think I'm gonna regret it <laughs> I think I might regret it I really like the company uh, I just I, I just think that uh, I've seen a lot of things go down lately. So it could be a bad time for them to do the IPO. They might want to delay it longer. And maybe I can use those funds on something else like BVO right now. So, all right, guys. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education, entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here at Rich TV Live. In When you invest in something, make sure you understand what you're investing in. Right here, High Times was, for $50 million, they were raising $50 million for 4.545454 million shares. So that's how many shares they were selling. And it just seems like there's a small amount of shares, but how many other shares will be issued? This is not showing us that. This is just showing us how much they're selling those shares for. So if they only have 4 million shares, yeah, you know what? This thing could fly. So, I mean, I don't know all those specifics based on this uh, this offering here, but that's what I got for you guys. So, hey, let me know what you guys think. If you like this video, please smash that like button, comment, share the video everywhere. If I win and you win, we all win. I like it, but man, $11? I don't know. What do you guys think? It's your boy Rich. It's bringing you the truth, guys. Sorry, man. But you can get it back. If you want to get it back, you can get your cheese back. But hey, if you want to buy it, you can buy it too. Let me know what you're going to do. I'm out. Peace.